A local family of a black man shot and killed by a deputy in Hazel Dell back in February is suing Clark County. You may remember the shooting happened during a traffic stop. Investigators say Genoa Donald resisted arrest. He was unarmed. This comes just three months after the family of Kevin Peterson Jr., who was also shot and killed by deputies, filed their own lawsuit against the county. Fox 12's Brenna Kelly joins us now live after hearing from Genoa Donald's mother and brother this morning. Brenna? The emotions are still raw for Genoa Donald's family. His mother and brother say they want answers and they want the officers involved to be held accountable. The family of a man shot and killed by a deputy during a traffic stop in Hazeldale in February is suing Clark County for what they call the wrongful death of Genoa Donald. Deputies said in February Donald did not comply with commands, resisted arrest, and pulled a deputy into his car. At some point, one deputy shot the 30-year-old. Donald later died at the hospital. Documents show officers reported seeing weapons in his car. Evidence later revealed Donald did not have a gun. I would have never in a million years believed that my son was shot in the head by the Clark County Sheriff. He didn't deserve this. Nobody deserves this. Donald's mother, Sue Zawacki, and his brother, Josh Shorthill, spoke to reporters today saying the 30-year-old struggled with a learning disorder and drugs, but was the friend others depended on. He would give anyone the shirt off his back. I want the truth to come out. I want to know what happened. I want answers and I just, I just want to know because this is tearing me apart inside. And it's one of the worst feelings I've ever had. Attorney Mark Lindquist, who's representing the family, says Donald was the target of an illegal pretextual stop. He says deputies stopped Donald because they believed he was leaving a drug house, but they did not have probable cause to pull him over for a drug crime. So instead, officers claimed it was for a broken taillight. In Washington state, the Supreme Court has held in State v. Ladson that officers cannot use traffic stops to pull over somebody to suspect of a different crime when they don't have probable cause for that crime. And the Clark County Sheriff Chuck Atkins sent a statement in response to the filing of this tort claim. It says in part, the investigation into this incident has been handled by an outside agency and the Clark County Sheriff's Office has had no role in the investigation. The investigation has been forwarded for the prosecuting attorney's review and we are waiting the conclusion of that step in the process. The sheriff says the death of Genoa is tragic and his condolences are with the family. Reporting live, Brenna Kelly, Fox 12, Oregon.